All right, all right. Listen up. In the new year, we promise to upload more starting January the 1st. Because this year, we said we would upload 24 videos. We're sorry. Because oh. we uploaded 25! We didn't win a Golden Gnome this year either. Because oh. we've already won it! Trinome Entertainment were charging us 10 mil a gnome for tonight's party. Oh. So we fucked them all! Bring those little gremlins in here. Oh, what day is it? Oh no. Jen, you need to get up now. The fans are going to be absolutely raging. Oh, calm down, Dave. It's only January the 1st. We've got loads of time. See? January the 20th. Ah, Hello everybody and welcome to Old School Runescape Challenges, episode number 147. I'm here with Jensen, so how are we doing? Alright, to be honest. Jensen, the new year! Happy New Year everyone! Come on, Jen! I'm messing, happy New Year lads. Happy New Year, happy New Year. As you've probably seen from the title, me and Jen are doing the 1GP, take it to the GE and see how much we can make flipping. We did do a video very similar to this over two years ago where we did one GP trade up, where we went to GE and we just traded up through trades. This yeah. gen, we're strictly doing it flipping on the Grand Exchange. Now you're probably thinking, Dave, I've seen this somewhere else. Yes, this video has been inspired by the one GP videos that you've seen from a friend. He did one a couple of years ago. Uh, and also Puggles done one. Obviously, you boys have got to put the uh, the challenge spin on it, as there is two of us. So, me and Jen are going to flip on the Grand Exchange, starting with 1GP for a hybrid Mage and Melee gear setup. We are going to have a two-day time limit. Now, the reason for this is we cannot stay logged in for eight hours and wait for stuff to buy. Like, stuff is going to take a long time to buy. Me and Jen are both going to start at 6pm tonight, which is in a couple of minutes and finish at 6 p.m. in two days' time. So you can do overnight flipping, be at work, do a bit of flipping there on your phone, no, that kind of thing, Jen. At the end of the time limit, we will hand our hybrid gear setups over to two equally matched in terms of stats, who will represent either Team Tanzu or Team Fatoso, Jen. The loser of the fight will lose for their team, and both members, we've never done this before, both members of the team will receive a forfeit. So that means, Jen, if my team loses, the person who's representing me will receive a forfeit as well as me, even though I had nothing to do with the fight. If you do like this video, drop a like, it helps us out massively. And if this video does well, then we could potentially turn this into a series where we keep working off the money that we have made and do it as a, like, a little, little side series alongside the challenge videos. If you want to see that, let us know. Obviously, if you let us know, we'll look into it. If you don't, We'll just assume you don't want it. <laughs> Subscribe if you want to see some content. No, on a serious note, we are going to be uh, uploading as much as we can. Obviously, we both have full-time jobs, so it is difficult. Let's get into the video, Jen. Three, two, one, go. Mm -hmm. Your time starts now, Jensen. See you in a bit, lad. See you in we'll a see bit. You, see you in two days. So, well, yeah, see you in two days. Good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here ready to start the... Ch Sorry, I'm distracted by his... F what is he wearing? What are you wearing, mate? Do you know what I mean? The thing I just noticed, which is actually really me off, right? Is that it's one coins. Why is it plural? Why is it plural? GCSE English ting. Right, in terms of items then, we're going to have a, a cheeky little scout. Obviously, either bronze and iron is probably the best types of items to go with, but I don't want to be stuck with something that's just not going to resell. Uh, example being bronze javelin heads. Um, no thank you. Right, so the trick is going to be to find an item that is very obscure and people are just going to chuck in the GE for 1GP. Like, when I go into this tab, I just click stuff, I go to the GE, I put it in for 1GP and I hope it sells, right? Things like this are what I need to be looking at. Getting our first item for 1GP is going to be the hardest bit of this video. Bronze crossbow, that could be a very good item. Right, lads, so I've just come back and I believe our bronze chain body has bought for a total of 1GP. I'm going to whack it straight in. How much do I sell it for? Because I need the money to reinvest, like... Right, we're going to leave it at 49 for a bit, and we'll see what happens. Finally, our first item has bought the Bronze Spear. It's taken me 1 hour and 20 minutes to get the first item. Uh, I've tried Bronze Wire, Iron Battle Axe, Iron Mace. They're like 11 GP each. Uh, balls of Wool, that kind of thing. Like, kind of obscure items. How much does this reset? It's never going to sell for that. If that sells, I've turned 1 GP into 550. And look at that, not long later, it actually sold to 49 GP. So, I'm going to put an offering for a couple items. Uh, I'm going to bed soon, so I want to basically fill up the slots. Um, basically all 8, 
maybe for like a couple GP items, see if we can get some steals and stuff like that, and then hopefully log in the morning, and I'm just greeted with all this garbage, basically. Hello, hello, hello. One GP into 425. Let's buy 10 of them. By the way, it took me an hour and 10 minutes to sell that bronze beer. Good morning, gang. I'm gonna check G now. I'm hoping to see more green than St. Patrick's Day, lad. You know what I mean? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. <sighs> right, so we've got a fire tiara for one GP, first of all. Oh, fing hell, Jensen, you've really dropped the fing ball there, haven't you, sunshine? Three bronze spears have bought for one GP. This could be uh, monumental. These bronze spears could be our, our go to moneymaker right now. Right, let's try and sell it for like 25 GP. Great. We, bought, we got a bronze full out for 15 coins. Right, these are getting cancelled. Obviously, they're not buying. My bronze chain bodies aren't doing the business anymore either, so we're going to cancel all of them. Right, lads, I've got no clue what I'm doing, I'm gonna be honest. I I've shoved that in for 50 GP, I've shoved that in for 25. I tried buying an Iron Dark Poison Plus Plus for 10 GP and an Iron Knife for 10 GP. That'd be a big margin if I can actually get one of them. Steel Maces have kind of traded a fair amount because they needed for an easy clue. I just bought a bag of salt because I'm salty as f basically. So I'm gonna leave them in for like an hour and come back and hopefully something's happened. Oh, hello. Look at that return. Zoom in on that return. Buy 1GP, sell 425, 2.1k. In four hours, but um, it's going well. All right, lads, good news. I've cancelled the other offers. Uh, the bronze flower was sold. I had to drop it again for 28GP. The fire tiara isn't selling. Hopefully, it eventually sells. Um, in the meantime, I'm thinking to go about going for the iron plate legs. Let's try and get some for like 40GP or something, then we can hopefully double our money. All right, so I was just doing some research and the iron plate legs are bought, so we're gonna dump them back in. You know what I mean? I'm splashing the cash out here, boys. I'm splashing the cash out. Oh, look at that lovely stuff. So our iron plate legs are bought for 95, uh, sold for 95 GP, puts us on 96. So we've made like, what, we bought for 40. So we made a decent amount there. Lads, these iron plate legs, boys. These iron plate legs, we found our money maker here, boys. We find our money maker. I think this is it, you know. I think this is the one. What's the what's the place called in Harry Potter? Fucking Goblin's Bank or whatever it's called. Just like that, they've sold again. Right, I've dumped all my money into Iron Plate Legs. I've bought four. If I can if I can make this work, I'd be making 45 GP on each. That's like what 180 GP. Boom, like that. And then we're getting into the fucking big boy money. Shout out my man, no look, fuck in the chat. Hashtag Team Vitoso. He knows what it is. When uh, the GE says that Steel Axe is 336 GP, so you buy it for 90 and it instantly buys. I think these will buy overnight, and I don't see why they wouldn't sell again tomorrow. Another bronze spear, literally literally the only thing that has bought in ages. These bronze spears, they literally sell within 5 minutes. Another 400 GP. This is the only thing I'm making my money off right now, is bronze spears. I've just witnessed a tribal mask buy in front of me. 600 GP that bought for. A new weapon to the arsenal, an iron spear is bought for 10 GP. I've literally just bought a bronze spear for 1 GP, put it in for 425 and it's sold within 10 seconds. Right, so I've just sold the fire tiara out of rage, it wasn't selling for 3 GP. I picked ourselves up a Fremenic Brown Cloak for 51 GP. I'm hoping I could sell this for a little bit more. I'll shove it at 250 and we'll see how we get on with that. My offers are too cheap. Like, it's just not working. Nothing seems to be f***ing working. Everything I try, which I think is going to work, doesn't f***ing work. The game's fixed. Right, some La Rupia for has bought for 38 coins. We're going to sell this now for about 240. I mean, it says 591, but that isn't the price it's selling for. So we'll go for about 245 and hopefully... This bad boy ends up selling. And after some time, my steel axe was sold for 250 GP, 170 P GP profit there. I have made 700 coins on my black leprechaun hat. I've just took a, uh, a little stab in the dark and gone for these boots, right? And he just insta-sold and I got money back. As you can see on screen, another two of these sold. I'd be very silly not to buy some more bronze spears overnight. I am going to leave these offers in now for overnight. They are our offers. I will see you in the morning. La Rubia, la Rubia, la Rubia, la Rubia, la Rubia. Two hundred forty-five GP. That's a fucking banger of a flip, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna I'm, this fur. This fur might get me out of the dark place I'm in the minute. I'm gonna pop it in for like thirty-five again, and I'm gonna try and buy like a ton overnight. Um, hopefully in the morning when I wake up, something will sell. Um, I've had a really 
day to day. Um, just nothing selling, nothing's buying. See you in the morning, bright and early, ladies and gentlemen. La Rubia. It is half eight in the morning, and I've just heard the very nice sound of jingling bells from the Grand Exchange. Oh, okay. 39 bronze spears have bought. I'm going to stick with what I've been been selling for if they sell 16k <sighs> right it's the following morning we're gonna have a quick look now to see if our la rubia have bought and we can hopefully make some more la rupees to get today do you get it rupees <sighs> shit nothing's buying nothing's selling how much is that, that one? Oh, get a fucking grip then 39 bronze spears, which has made me 17k. I've also sold the Viawatch boots for double the money, 2k. And I've also sold the iron spear that I bought for 10 coins for 950. 25k when that sells. We've got the Tingo skirt at pop, 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 skippy doo bop, pop, and a bum, bum, pur, bum. Scat fur? That's not selling. Nothing's buying. Nothing's selling. The scat fur is coming down. There's going to be hands. Hands are getting thrown, ladies and gentlemen. That's all I can say. Hands are going to be getting thrown. Put an offering to buy some iron plate legs, which has actually done it for 50 GP. So that's not bad. Um, I'm saying not bad. They sell for 80 GP. Fucking hell, Jensen. You're in the money. Oh. Dave, what are you doing? Do you know what I mean? I'm sat here like, flipping fucking Larupia fur. What is going on? We do have some uh, blue shorts, which I've bought for 2k each, and these are taking a very long time to buy. Hello, this is very nice indeed. We have just got ourselves 6k from the shorts, and they did sell, which makes me think I could probably get a bit more for these. What's that, like 200 GP I make if I sell these? Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad, you know. All right, this is good. They've sold. They actually sold. 460 GP, boys. Right, if we, right, listen. If that can sell, if these can sell, I can, I could be on some decent money here. And that's when we can really start to, you know, pump it up. You've got to pump it up. Do you know what I mean? So I need to find another item now. Right, we're making big movements here. We've, we've got an offering for a bullseye lantern, 460 coins. They're apparently actively trading for like K and a half, 2K, even more than that. So hopefully this buys. And then, then we can start to really can do something with the money because at the minute i'm just having to like go out for like an hour come back and nothing's buying nothing's selling i can't do anything i have bumped up the offer for the black carve and it's just bought for 20k like bang on which means someone has literally just put it in probably for less than this and it's bought for 20k so maybe get 40k for it and nothing else is really uh, doing anything I'm, it's just a waiting game still i am back from the gym i've just had a bit of a bit of a sesh with uh, ronnie coleman and arnold and and whatnot, so we're just, um, I had to catch up with them, couldn't really say no, so I'm back now, 2 hours 24 minutes has passed, and I don't think anything's bought or sold, <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, look at that on your screen, boom, I knew it would sell, we just made ourselves a whopping 20k on the black calf, I can get more, I could probably get about 50, 60k I think, oh, <laughs> oh, a black cavalier is just bought for 20k. I'm not even joking. What do you think? What do you think? Get 100k for it. Nope. 180! The bullseye lantern has come on in. 460 coins. People are apparently buying it for two two big ones, boys. So we're going to whack that in. <gasps> 180! Look at that, boys. How much did I buy it for? Like 450? Let's get three of the... I can't afford three of the... Let's get two of the... Knowing Jen, like he's normally quite good at this stuff, so I, I reckon I'm doing I'm doing well. I am doing well, but I, I I guarantee he is a similar stage to me. Right, with our leftover money, we've gone and <laughs> classic iron plate legs again. We're gonna bang these in. Hopefully, we can make a decent profit like last time. Hmm, would you look at that? My iron plate leg seems to have sold for a lot of profit. So that made me about 250 GP. It's music to my ears, lads. The bullseye lantern's bought, and I've moved on to iron plate bodies. The iron plate legs don't seem to be working anymore. These are buying for about 101 coins. Come on, boys, they're selling. They're fucking selling like hotcakes, boys. Look at them go. Go on, and again. Step right up, Matoso's fucking plate bodies, boys. Oh, this is sick now. See, we've got ourselves out of the rut, lads. We can, we've actually got a bit of substance, a bit of revenue. We can use it, invest it. Right, lads, they are sold now. Boys, right, we're going to reinvest. We're... Boys, come on, these are sold as well. Let's f***ing do this shit. Come on. Oh, some shorts just sell, literally, as I'm rolling the clip. 4K turnover there. Another 10 minutes goes by and another Black Cavalier buys. 
One and a half hour later, no luck on anything other than these shorts. We have just bought our very first thing in a very long time. A honourable blessing for 2.9k. Oh, hello. We got ourselves a Snelm for 2.7k. Put this in and try it. <laughs> Is it going to sell, though? Are we going to make 20k on a Snelm? Probably not. That's nice. A nice little just under 4k. Lads, I'm not going to lie to you all right now, all right? I've put this in, I've gone for a poo, I've come back and it's sold. I've made 20k having a poo. <laughs> oh my god, the bullseye sold already. The the plate body's bought way too quick for my liking, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to throw them in anyway. Right, our other lantern is bought. I might have to drop the price of the plate bodies because they're just stuck at the minute and I'm going to have the cash so I can start trading them actively. Hoping, I'm just massively hoping that they sell because that's a huge amount of money there. <laughs> right then, okay. Thank you very much. Oh, come on. It's all coming into fruition, boys. It's all coming into fruition at the minute. Right, the bull, the bullseye. The other bullseye sold. Okay. Okay. How much do we fancy, Jensen? How much are we feeling? Are we feeling 2K? I fancy 2K. I don't know about you. The machete sold for one night. I should have kept... Right, hello. This is unbelievable. I'm buying more. I'm buying more Snelms. Snell me up. Four times on a daily. Nice and pointy. 30 seconds later, a Snelm has bought again. Dare I go 25k? And a pirate hat has also just bought. I've literally just put this offer in. We could be in the money right now. I do not believe it. 19k. We've literally made like 40k just off them. I bumped up the price just to try getting because they are flying off the shelves. Let me tell you. Well, we've just logged back on. So we're going to have a look how... Whoa! Look how much f***ing green there is. Nice, 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 nice. Right. Our 12 plate bodies have bought for 102 coins. Hopefully those do indeed sell. Skiat! Fur has sold for 499. That's a decent profit there. Uh, also the Larupia fur, fur has sold for 199. We bought that for about 40-ish, so nice bit of profit. Our five machetes have all bought, which I'm very surprised about. Laz, if they sell. Come on! I'm going in the fight with a fucking VLS. Go on, my son. Oh, lads, I'm loving this now. I'm loving this. Now, I found a few items which are working for me. The bone dagger isn't dying, uh, buying, so I'm going to take that out right now. Oh, my God. And another five of bought. <laughs> um, did we go 35k? I mean, I've got I've done an 8k jump, and, you know, people had no problem <laughs> buying that. Black calves, really struggling with these. I sold one so easily, like, such a quick turnaround, and now I just can't get rid of these two. I literally have the Snell market on strings right now. I'm running the Snell market right now. Money, money, money. Bah. Iron plate bodies, 12 of them. These are still selling, but we still got some cash. We're going to put all these together. We'll drop it to like 158 each. I'm probably going to log off now whilst these iron plate bodies are selling. They are selling like hotcakes, boys and girls. So you better get in quick if you f***ing want one. Do you know what I mean? Literally, you can win this video by doing like a 1GP buy for like a 20 k item. That can happen. So, as long as there's nothing like that going on on Dave's side, right, we should be good. We should be good. Oh my god. You love to see it. I put these in not long ago. I've just sold two in 30 seconds apart. I've got another one as well. I've got another one. I am running the Snell market right now. Put a Snell on my head. This Snellm is going to haunt Jen. It's honestly going to haunt him. I'm just making money. Right, our ancient stole is bought for 3.4k. I'm going to try bang it in for like 6k and hope for the best. Please, some it buy, some it sell, just anything. Oh my god, yes. Yes! 9k for the machetes! Up the boys! The combo's bought. The ancient stole... This is perfect, lads. Right, I put an offering for two ancient blessings for 7300. We can probably sell these for about 10k-ish, hopefully. The bullseye lanterns are selling like hotcakes, boys. 180. That's 3.5k in the bag. Hello, hello. Look, boom, green, green, boom, boom. It literally insta, it insta stopped. It insta sold. Another blessing has sold for 9.9k. I'm gonna bump this offer up slightly because I think someone might be doing the same thing as me, which would not be good. Ancient blessing has sold again. The bullseye lanterns have sold. The other machete sold. Look at the money floating in. <laughs> I am running the snail market. I've got snails on tap right now. I've just bought another five. These have sold. <laughs> okay. We bought we bought three for 24k. We've turned it in to 90. And if I do my maths correctly, 
that's 66k profit. We've also just sold another for 30k. We've also sold this 1.7k on it. Yes, yes! Give me more! Tell me more, tell me more! I want ancient blessing! Why did my voice go so high then? We've just purchased an adamant warhammer for just over 5k. We're gonna sell that for around 7,400. That's about 2k margin on that. Hopefully that sells. And would you look at that? We come back, we've made like what, 2.5k plus on the uh, Addy Warhammer. We've got ourselves the Ancient Blessings, they both sold as well. That puts us almost on 30k, and we've got seven machetes, which I'm going to try and pawn off here for about. Try 1950. A Slayer Staff is bought for 20.6k. We're going to sell that for around 23.9, I think. That would be a nice little bit of money. Well, the lantern sold straight away, basically, so that's good news. The machetes aren't selling. Brown Cloak's not going! Sell! Right, Holy Blessing has bought. We're going to try sell this off now for about 22k, I'm hoping. That's the item. Let's get let's, let's get them going, boys. Let's get them going. Come on. Right, so ladies and gents, we do only have roughly two hours left. So we've told each other that we're, we're not really allowed to buy any. I mean, if we've got some quick flips going, we can do them. But things like I've got going here that take a while to sell, we are going to stop doing it. And we're just going to dump everything we have, put the offers in and watch it sell. There we go. We're going to let these sell now over the next two hours. And then we are done. Snailed it. All right. See in a bit. It's only 6k a flip, lads. Right, another blessing's bought. That is a blessing in itself. And we've also got a... <laughs> I'm rushing. I've also got a bagged maple tree, which I believe we can sell for a little bit of profit as well. 13.8k that maple tree sold for. Holy. How much did we buy it for? 8.5. Fuck off. Oh my god, it sold. Yes! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is how we are looking. We're basically at the end now, coming up, um, I sold one for 25k and they wouldn't sell, so I've had to drop down at 215 and they're selling. I've just got one left to sell. Uh, the Black Clav sold relatively soon after dropping them to 1k above what I bought them for, so I did make 2k on the Black Clavs. Just waiting on this last 15k and we are done, which leaves us on a total of 555,250 coins from one GP. I will be surprised if Jen's, Jen's made more than me. I don't even know how much I've made off these snelms. Nine snelms for 45K, sold eight of them for 176. My gear setup is gonna be sick. Right, with everything sold, lads, we have a grand total of 116K. Um, We're gonna go ahead and start buying the gear setup now. Right, lads, we are here with the gear setups. We are with Ollie and Jack. Do you wanna introduce yourself, Jack, first? Yeah, all right, lads, it's Jack RS flying in. Then we got Ollie. All right, boys, Stortford here. Right, so what we're going to do is a coin flip. Who wants heads? Who wants tails? God, I'll take heads. Right, you ready? I'm going to flip. Never fails. It was heads. Jack, who do you want, me or Jen? Uh, pick wisely. No, pick very wisely. I'll take, I'll take Jeno because he Go ahead. Right, so. Will you? Yeah, okay, okay. First thing, put your me set up on first. What now? Yeah. Oh no! Oh my god! What's this? Oh, mate, the melee's even worse, man. Oh, is it? No. Go ahead and put your uh, melee set up on. <laughs> what is that? Lad, why has he got a gimp mask? What have you done to me? It was the point of me even competing in this. No main defense. And I've got a DDS as my main fucking weapon. <laughs> He's not gonna need water in his gen. Three, two, Mama one. So Go. Wait, I'm not sure about protect range considering there's no range involved, but. Oh, <laughs> oh Jack! Oh, oh. What are you doing, man? Jack, you I'm gotta praying... get. Yeah, I'm praying melee, innit? Jack, you gotta get the overheads on there, sunshine. Never. Oh! <laughs> Free prey! Jack! Jack! <laughs> Give you a bit of a staff bash, there you go, have that. Oh, go ahead, they're, they're the freezes we want. That's nice, Jack, that's nice, Jack. That's composure. That black deer body could purchase. Oh, I'm, I'm poisoned. <laughs> Great idea. It's like 7k because you're not afford it. Splash city in it. That's nice. That's nice, Jack. That's get get the rock. Oh, what the, the fuck? He, what the fuck is he doing? Oh, Look, I like he's that. I've been blasted. Yeah, it's not an issue. Jack, you can't keep up with you at the minute. Ancient staff versus water. Boom. Oh. <laughs> I supplied a recoil as well, Jen, if you noticed. Oh, I just barraged. Oh, that great deep. stuff. That's great stuff, Jack. Boom! Oh, he got it off on the prayer. Oh, it's Jack! Quite, it's quite even. 
No pressure, Ollie. Jack! I can't Ollie! <laughs> Sorry. Fine, it's calculated. If you need to- What? Oh, you need to eat, you need to eat, okay? I'm getting bodied. <laughs> this is it, Jack! This oh, is it! Dude. This I've got is no it. specs left. We're not losing, Ollie. Ooh! Oh! Little, little stab. Little stab a really. Keep him on his toes. That recoil's doing the only damage right now. God, this is He's in every game. game. Frog robes are doing business. Man, mm -hmm. this, this, is where, this is where it goes bad for me because he's got fucking black DI. Yeah. <laughs> Just catching him. No problem. Still catching freezes on him. I mean, you can attack back if you want. Oh, I like that. I like that as well. These skims scaring me. Nervous, oh my god, I'm stupid. I just brewed down. I haven't got a restore left. He's in his. He's in. He's Go on, nervous. Jack! Just relax, it's fine. I'm out of roots! No! <laughs> Jack! There's no roots! You're not right, giving him enough roots! Still got so, still got so, still got so. Give him the cast you fucking gave! <laughs> I'm out of roots! No! I mean... <laughs> oh. Go on, Jack! They're both out! They're both out! Go on, lad! Go on, Jack! Poke him! Poke him! Poke him! No! Yes! Poke him! No! Come on! Yes! Come on, Jack! Poke him, come on! Yes! How's he won that, then? That's bits, Jack. That's bits. I'm an actual disgrace. He's got a rock shell helm. That's it, bro. It's the rock. That's it, man. It's the rock shell helm, isn't it? Take him on his loot. You love to see it. Got a rock shell helm. Unreal. That was one of the best fights we've ever done. That was so sick. When it started, he started it in the 32s. I was like, oh, it's not looking good. I know. It was. It was. It was not looking good. I was a bit rusty, you know. What the sort of options we've got? Literally anything. Was it him that went really dry on Chaos Element or that? No, it was me. Don't bring that up, Jack. You and Ollie are going to go around the GE. You're going to be handing out rock shell helmets to everybody you see <laughs> with your auto chat saying the following. We are overwhelmed by the rock oh. shell helmets. So, so Jack of the past. Yeah? Are we good? Are we good? I think that's pretty funny. I don't know about you. Jen, it's your, it's your Overwhelmed problem, rock shell helm. <laughs> I'm spitting bars, Dave. Jen, they don't buy. Right, this is going to be Jen's master flipping plan where he's selling them for like 600k. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Imagine that. Buy for it. <laughs> <laughs> Can I do a different item? Oh, there you go. 20 each, yeah? Right, I bought them. Yeah, yeah. It's got level 65. Bro Brocco Lee looks like he could have one. Doing a bit of alking. Oh, oh lad, really... there's a guy that have a rune skim and a fucking Addy Kanchi. Yeah, I tried. He, he is it, is it Jack? <gasps> but he Jack or not, he still beat you. Give a few, you don't have to give one each as well, you can give a few people. She looks like she could use one, she's been in the San Casino. I'll give you like four, mate. Wait, he's just put 3k up. I'm just giving him nine. <laughs> he just keeps putting lobsters up, so I just keep putting plates up. <laughs> Wait, just take the plates. <laughs> he's just taking my old stock off me. I like his name, you can have two. See you later, mate, you know, you can have two. There you go, there's another two mil. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching this episode of Old School Rune Escape Challenges. I believe that was episode 148, am I right, Dave? 47. Uh, thanks very much for watching. Uh, big shout out to Jack and Ollie for joining us on this crazy journey. No, just big shout out to Jack. Big shout out <laughs> yeah, to Jack on. for that, <laughs> the, that absolute rock shell madness. <laughs> Cheers for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below any forfeit or ideas. Uh, and we also read all the comments, uh, apart from the ones where you call me a ginger prick. See you later.